unlucky and not the result we wanted, but we can be proud of the run, proud of the performance today and, and proud of all of it really, can't we? Yeah, um, club's come a bit, of a bit of a long way in a short period of time really. We were um, obviously wasn't here, but down the bottom of the league last year for a long period and sat here just outside the playoffs on the same points as playoffs teams and able to have the luxury to come to a um, top championship Premier League team really um, and see where our level is. Um, Levels obviously a little bit underneath theirs, but we've we've competed and we've given ourselves, a, uh, you know, a good account of ourselves second half, I think, um, and we've get, we've we've helped them along the way with a couple of goals. Um, that's football. Yeah, exactly as you say. It, it it can be a bit frustrating, maybe that they, they they got a bit lucky with those goals, but in reality, we can be actually looking at that and say, well, without those, we'd have bit, the scoreline would have been a lot closer and yeah. we did give ourselves a bit of justice. Well, that's it, yeah, but th th this is football with buts and maybes and um, there's games this season where teams have given us opportunities and they would come away from the EBB and say that if we didn't give them a goal, it would have been only 2-1 rather than 3-1 and, and stuff like that, but um, they've got quality that can hurt you. They've got players that uh had a lot of money for um, and that gets you quality and that ultimately gets your results and we needed them to be a bit off their game and us, us to be on our A game to, to sort of <clears throat> to sort of narrow narrow the gap down and that wasn't the case today. They were good and we were not at our full best um, without disgracing ourselves. We did get that goal eventually, didn't we? And uh, that was a nice moment for the fans to go home with and, and an even nicer moment for, for young Ollie. Yeah, um, tough for him really. Mm. Um, he obviously came in and he was ill for a period and now he's gone and scored so um, hopefully that's the first of many. For um, for Ollie Bray in, in all the shot colours and um, yeah, nice to get a goal really and, and the support today was brilliant. Um, I played for some some really good football clubs and um, and that was as good as away support I've I've had behind me. So um, really really do appreciate that and it's back now to Bishop Stortford in the cup next week and um, that game should be just as important to us as, as today was and um, looking forward to the league, looking forward to finishing as high as we can and. Um, seeing what we can make of this season. As you mentioned there, you have played at you know, a good level. Yep. You've played at stadiums like this. Was Did it kind of fall to you to, to give a bit of a, a bit of advice to some of the younger lads in the squad that haven't had that experience yet? Um, if it needed to be, then I would have been able to, but I didn't, uh, it didn't seem like that, I don't think. Lads lads have got enough personality, and, and ego is maybe the wrong word, enough personality to, <clears throat> to come here and, and try and impose themselves on the game. They don't need their hand held. Um, we've got players that are top, top players in our league and I've said it before, can go and play in, in higher leagues whenever that time comes. Um, and I don't think lads came in and shied away. They tried to show show who they are and how they play and, and, and try and impose themselves on the game. So it wasn't needed, but <clears throat> I just think that the, some of the lads in our team um, should be aspiring to come and play at stadiums like this every single week um, and not be a one-off every couple of years in the FA Cup to be able to come to these sort of grounds and and be the regular. We've certainly showed, especially in the second half, that we can go toe to toe with them. Some brilliant spells of possession. <coughs> Maybe things not quite dropping for us where we yeah. wanted to get the shot away, but we can really take that forward with us for the rest of the season. Yeah, yeah, of course. We've come here and we've not disguised ourselves against a um, top championship team, and um, they've got brilliant players, really good players that um, that know the game. They've played hundreds of games and. Um, it was nice to come and test ourselves against and see where your level is as an individual, as a team, and so well drilled. You know, we were just speaking to Jack in the shower there, and the way their back four were up and down, and just different level, different level. And um, it's not. It, I really enjoyed it, to be honest. Really enjoyed playing. Really enjoyed today. You briefly mentioned it earlier. Obviously, the next game we have is against mm -hmm. lower opposition than yep. ourselves. It's, it's a bit of a jump in mentality and a bit of a jump in preparation yeah. for us, isn't it? But yeah, of course. Um, but I think we've got the characters and the gaffer definitely won't be when we change the way he approaches it and that will filter through to the players and I don't think we've got the sort of players that will <coughs> will look down on opposition below us and stuff. We've we've had to do it already when we played lose and we and we managed to dust them 4-1 so um, hopefully it's just the, the, almost sort of like reverse of today really. We, we need to impose our quality next week and, um, and let them feel the level.